do you miss all this? Do you miss the buzz competing and going out there? I don't know. I, I do, I mean... Because I, you know, I, 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 you know, when I speak to you, I, I think you need to give it... Because uh, I think there's still money in the sport, but I don't think there's anyone, there's no one, no entrepreneurial person out there willing to go and get it. No, it's... Someone needs to go and get it. Someone does. I just... And create it. Like I, I mentioned this, the Red Bull thing for F1. Yeah. Fantastic idea. No, it would be a great idea to, to, to ship a ramp around and, and put it's them just, shows it's on. Just, it's, it's, just, it's, just, it's just pitching this idea to, yeah. you know, and, 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 and doing it because, you know, I do believe all the big sponsors, you know, like the Red Bulls, the Monster, they all, they, you know, they're all owned by massive global brands. Yeah. They've got millions and millions of pounds of a sponsorship to, 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 to push. They do. They want the young kids to buy yeah. their drinks. And you do, and, and you also, you want, you want to be able to push push that sport out to different fields, different eyes. You know, that is the problem at the minute, it's very trapped. There's only certain people seeing the sport. There's not, not even a magazine where if you went in WH Smith's now, yeah. you may see a, a cool front cover, oh wow, what's that? That's gone, so unless you Google it, it's or like, you're it's there. Like, it's um, like pitching, pitching to I, television, for tele, television shows, yeah. and demos, school, in front of school kids. Oh, there's definitely a lot more we can do. Mm. I mean, for me, contest-wise, I'm, I'm done. I sat on a ramp a couple of years ago in, in the south of France, and I was like, no. I, I prefer to go and have a pizza than do the run. I was done. Pizza. I was hungry. <laughs> I was I want a pizza. You know, it sounds funny, because I'm looking on the deck, I'm thinking, I'm, I mean, I would have been like 30, what, 31. I'm thinking, I'm, I'm one of the, I'm the oldest guy here. Everyone's 20. I've got more to get, I've got more to give the sport than sitting on the ramp. If I do something, I want to change the sport and bring something into that's, it. That's when, to, I, when, I, yeah. when I was at Keenan Skate Clubs and I first met you, yeah. you were out there with your, with your GoPro talking to people. And that's the energy because most kids or even uh, ex-pro riders yeah. won't have that courage no. to do that. No, it's, and that's bringing a little bit of showbiz. Yeah. Uh, showbiz is... To it, yeah. the sport. And that's what it needs. It needs it. It needs to bring back... It needs, it needs some sort of rock stardom back exactly. that kind of glitz glamour las vegas uh, you, you know uh, either, even the la type thing you know where x games used to be mm. when it was that weekend and it was in la it's like the boys are in town let's let's get the job done same with vegas we're here you know and that was that was bmx moto skate you know it, it, it was big and now i think it's a nitro nitro circus, nitro circus. You know, that's big as well, that's huge. What's that, like Cirque du Soleil, but on motors, like motorbikes mm. and BMX and skateboards? And... Pretty much, yeah. I mean, it is a circus, because the stuff the guys do, a lot of that stuff's not going to happen on a normal ramp. You know, they've built them ramps specially. I mean, you know, Josh Sheeney did the triple flip on a dirt bike, the, you know, motorbike. Them boys are doing quad flips now as well on BMX. But it wouldn't happen unless Nitro Circus and Travis, Travis Pastrana yeah, yeah. would have... Does he own this? I think he, I think he, he owns it. He, he, he is not, if he owns it or not, he is Nitro Circus, you know. Um, so it's big, real big stuff going on, you know. I mean, at his house, we, we had the privilege of going to his house and the stuff he's got set Where, up where's there. He he's, yeah. in, he's in Maryland, so he's East Coast. Um, yeah, it's, it's unbelievable. The, the land he's got, you get, you get he's lost. Made, you know. He's at the... Pinnacle is he's the best. He's the best. He's the best. He's you know. I mean, every X Games when it was the best trick. Yeah. yeah again, same thing. What's Travis going to do? I mean, the other guy, but you know, Brian Deegan and, and these other big names, they all did cool stuff. But I think Travis was always the one to look out for. ESPN. If you if you was in the he's states, got, he's, got it that, was, he's got that showbiz name, isn't he? Yeah. He's, you know, everyone knows his brand. His 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 name is his brand. It is, you know. Or rally, even when he did rally, he, I think he was in I don't know how many events, but like probably nine nine events or something over that weekend. Yeah. So the commercial before X Games started, it would be like, what's Travis gonna do? Rally, moto, best trick, blah blah goes on. You know, the list goes on. You know, so he could have really won four or five. Gold medals so, so, in one. So, thing. what have you been up to now? What are you, what are you doing now? So now I've just I've uh, since I've been back from the states, I've been you know I did a lot of stuff for becoming a sports agent mm. and dealing with some athletes and stuff like that. Yeah. Did did all you know did all the uh, 
the college stuff for that. Yeah. I think, you know, I think, I think the sports agent as well, that is definitely a, a good thing, you know, to it, get into. It, it, is a, it definitely is a good thing for me. For a sports agent, I, everything I learned was is all US based. Mm. So you know, it's contract negotiations, stuff, you know, NFL stuff, all the collegiate sports, what you can and cannot do, why the, ki the guys are in college, um, you know, when you can approach them to sign them, because there's a lot of rules, you know. So it's learning all that stuff, uh, you know. Rules for what? Just you, you, you can't just approach college kids and be like, I want, I want to what, sign you. Because they're for, under a certain age? Under a certain age, yeah. And I've just, there's just a lot of rules what and regulations. For, what for? Uh, NFL, American football. American football yeah, yeah, more, like, American football was kind of the biggest, yeah. you know, a lot of rules in that stuff, you know. Um, so yeah, I guess all, all, the, all, all the American football kids as well, they're, they're talent spotted. But, but Years before by the, the big companies they are but you still can't approach them there's yeah. so many rules you, you know there's a lot of stories where you know agents would be like hey i'm gonna i want to sign you but let, let, let me uh let me buy your car yeah you know like you're reading this stuff what's that film called jerry Maguire. jerry Maguire. Mm. yeah fantastic movie yeah. you know um yeah there's a lot of stuff and so for me that them sports interest me because it's, it's away from what it sounds funny like sometimes you want to move away from a sport because you don't want to deal. Well, try, try, try well, you're dealing now, with your friends, you know. Like it's, exactly, but the most yeah. important for now is making some money, isn't it? It is just some money it. because you know, even though you can be involved with these, these sports you love and I yeah. love, if it doesn't pay the bills, well, exactly, well, you can't do it. No you know, and London is very it's football based, golf, tennis. Yeah. Do I do I do I love football? No. Do I love tennis? Yeah. I watch it, but yeah, I. I, I the, the passion isn't there, so so obviously now we we are where we are now. Yeah, yeah. So that's why so, I'm trying to you know get you to do something with you know build your get a, like your own brand up doing yeah. construction. Construction. So yeah. something like what what new new does in uh, London, you know, you want to try and do it. Um, what's what's the, what's the company called? ID Build. ID Build. That's a good so, name, isn't it? Yeah. ID Build. Interior design build. Yeah. Yeah, so you, know, you, can, you can like specialise in loft conversions, side returns, new builds, refurbishments. Pretty much, yeah. The you know, and, I, and, and, the, and the projects, you know, especially if you want to sort of focus on East London. Yeah. You know, if any deals come in which I get, you can, you can, yeah. you know, you can project manage yeah. and build up your team of subcontractors and contractors yeah. to do it. Yeah. And they're already kind of getting a team together exactly. already. Yeah, build a team, you know, build a team. just, you know, start off small, you know, that, um, the one I gave you yesterday, there's yep. that um, potential one, uh, some flooring to be, be, to be done, just little jobs, build little jobs. up, yep. build up. Yeah, and I'm, I'm excited. It's always something nice about this as well, because I've always been, I like to see, I like to see the, the start of a project. Exactly. And, and it's always great to see a, an outcome of what, yeah. what you've created. You know, that's what's nice about it. I've seen a finished product with a lot of stuff. Exactly. You always just get I'll, stuck I'll, and you don't, and you, everyone else sees it, but you're kind of working for someone else yeah. to where you're kind of like, did it happen, did it not? You know. Um, it's, it's, slow, it's, it's slowly, slowly, slowly because so, what, you know, you're going to be the personality, you're going to see the clients yep. selling. So you, obviously you've done, you've done a bit of construction before, you, yep. know, you know the backbones of you know, construction. So yep. it's about it's about you know putting your personality across to the to the client, getting their trust, getting your, yeah, coming in with a good estimate, and if they you're in their price range, hopefully go for the sale and close them down. That's it. And that's exciting. Yeah. You know, it's a little bit of everything you get to do with it. You know, so Keep the going. challenge is there, and I'm ready right. for it. Good. Let's follow it up. Well, Ronnie, yeah. thanks for coming in, mate. Thanks, Nick. And uh, great. Peace. <laughs> <laughs>